happy Thursday. All right, so today I wanted to talk about supplements and medication and the difference between the two. Um, just because I thought it was interesting um, when I was talking to the nutritionist from Designs for Health and we were discussing how different supplements help the body at a molecular level to work well. As, um, for instance, we were talking about how um, an organic acid test can help determine which amino acids um, vegetarians or vegans could be um, deficient in um, if they have trouble losing weight um, or if they're low on energy. And also we're talking about like how fiber can help digestion and manage blood sugar and lipid levels in the body and how it goes at a molecular level to help that. Ooh, and she was also telling me about how like we got this collagen powder that is great for hair, skin, and nails, but it has been clinically proven to rebuild cartilage. So, all of my people who have knee injuries, knee replacements, or like knee anything, or joint issues, like, we can get you not only like feeling better, but we can develop a strength training plan to get you wherever you need to be. So, yeah, we gonna reclaim your life, boo. <laughs> but anywho, um, enough about this new project. Um, supplements. Um, I love them because, as I mentioned before, they work to restore your body at a molecular level. Now, some things you have to be aware about um, is that you have to make sure that they are one, are manufactured by a company that practices um, good, good developmental practices. Like, um, they don't put metals in it or they don't test it on animals and this and other stuff. Like, they, they put in it what it is. So when you're looking for supplements, you have to make sure that you are um, looking for the seals of seals. So they may write like, oh yes, we do the quality, 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 quality. We do all this and that. But unless it says it has the seal of, um, I want to say, good manufacturing practices, GMP, and another one is that it is. Um, I forgot that one, but there's a couple other seals that you have to make sure that they have. I'll put it in the comments below. Whatever. I can't remember right off the bat. I'm, I'm just trying to give y'all this little PSA. Whatever. <laughs> but, um, yeah. And one thing also about supplementation is that if you do it correctly, so if you work with a nutritionist, dietitian, or a certified transformational nutrition coach as myself... Um, you will be able to have the right amount. So that will um, make sure that one, you are getting quality supplements and you're getting the right amount for your condition or your um, deficiency and that you won't have any side effects. Now on the flip side, medication, um, some of it works with your body, but most of it um, forces your body to do something that is doesn't really want to do like it does it by force um medication and then some of the medication is just simply to reduce symptoms so some of the medica medication like um i remember somebody was telling me how they had gotten a headache and were starting to get really bad headaches so they went to the doctor and so then they just prescribed them um that new headache migraine medication and so it's supposed to stop the headaches and make you feel so much better but the side effects that came along with it made you so drowsy and lethargic like you can't really function with it so you can't really take it in the morning um, because you're going to be sluggish and drowsy throughout the entire day and you probably won't feel better until the end of the day and you will be unproductive so if you wait to take the medication at the very end of the day you'll just be suffering through the migraine and then by the time you take the medication and start to kick in it'll be time to go to bed 
So at least you'll get good enough sleep, I guess. Um, that is what medication does. Um, it does not really fix the problem. Not at a molecular level, it just stops the symptoms. It just like says, mm. stop, hush, hush, you good. And it just makes you keep doing the same thing. Like how many people do you know died of diabetes or died of a heart attack or died of heart issues and was taking blood pressure medication and was taking diabetes medication? Like, do you know like how expensive it is for people to keep up with their insulin monthly? Like people have to ration out their insulin because it's so expensive. This is like the world we live in with medication. But a lot of people feel like they cannot um, take the time out to um, exercise, to change their diet, to set boundaries, to do self-care practices. You know, I would take all of that over all of the other stuff and then even just having like, yeah. But that's medication. Those are the differences. Some medication works and you don't have to take it for long, um, but, you know, those aren't really ones that they push. Why do you think chronic disease is so prevalent, but it's easily managed by lifestyle factor, by lifestyle changes? Yeah. I don't know. I'm just a health coach, transformational nutrition coach. What do I know? Um, yeah, I hope this helps. But anywho, um, enrollment is still open. Um, and I have changed things around. So there are just three groups. MLP for people who have joint issues, um, musculoskeletal issues or they're just wanting to get back in shape and they want to get their whole life together, all right? Reclaim My Life, those are the individuals who have chronic diseases and they want to not have that stuff anymore. And my tap in coaching uh, program is for individuals who um, just want to mentally feel like themselves again like they want to be normal they want to feel whole again so that's more mental than anything so um yeah if you're interested let me know i still have some spots left um and we do the reset cleanse so um one thing about that i'm kind of excited about that because i have chocolate have you ever like heard of a reset cleanse where you can restore reset your bodily systems um, lose weight and eat healthy and eat chocolate at the same time I don't know it's awesome but <laughs> I'll tell you about that later but I hope this helps supplements medication <laughs> Happy Thursday, y'all.